so you uh, took a picture with Desi Banks uh, yesterday, yeah, yeah. and uh, you wow. you know y'all referring to yourselves as Eddie and Martin or something. Yeah. Uh, wh what's up with that? Yeah. yeah. And we got something coming for y'all. You heard? Big shit. Big shit. That's my dog, man. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. I was going to ask you what city you like performing the most, but we can't say that. So I'm going to say what city surprised you the most when you went there and they showed you crazy love that you didn't even they gonna see. They're going to get mad because it's... You just saying what? Which one that showed you crazy love you didn't support expect? Support you, support you. Yeah, the most. I ain't saying which one the best. Like when you that showed up, you didn't me. see like bam! Like I ain't know they were gonna do a show this love. Chicago, they showed mad love. Four shows, three of them sold out. Mm. They love Bubba Dude. That shit surprised you didn't expect that. out of me. They like ghetto boys the same way. I'm talking. It's about a Texas some, thing. I'm talking about some real hills. They loved you. Love me. And they wait around after the show to come tell you oh. how much. Oh yeah, oh yeah. And, they, and you know, the Higgles, they'll let you know. Like it's somebody who really got man in the. And this dude, it was in the wheelchair, so he like, it's dude, always I love you. <laughs> yeah, cool, cool, cool. And dude, like, dude, he really got nigga. You <laughs> <laughs> might want to go over and talk to him talk a little, to bit, him more a little bit more and really see what's going down. Mm -hmm. And um, beautiful people, man. Beautiful people, like really, like I could call them right now. I'm like, bro, I'm some, I'm coming to Chicago. They feel a red carpet for me. They gonna make sure everything. Make sure I'm good. good, and that's that made me feel good about my work because I help them get through that day. Mm -hmm. And what's so happened about it? When you see when I'm performing, I'm in that zone, and I might see somebody in the wheelchair. I'll come up with a joke that quick. Like true story, I was in um, North Carolina, and a guy in the wheelchair pulled up to the stage, and I say, "Man, I don't like niggas in wheelchairs." And the crowd see him, so they, "Why you gonna like it?" A nigga, a nigga like that man rolled off one of my holes one time. They've been rolling ever since. <laughs> and then, not knowing, he was one of them niggas. <laughs> wow. But I made him laugh and he loved it. Man. And, they, and then people say, man, nigga don't never laugh at shit. You made that nigga laugh. Mm -hmm. Wow. And that nigga gave me something to smoke. And his homeboy, That's it. And his homeboy was like, that nigga don't never give away nothing. <laughs> 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 nigga, you special. <laughs> man, That's dang. So crazy. <laughs> Go ahead. No, go. Okay, yeah. So, so you uh, took a picture with Desi Banks uh, yesterday, yeah, yeah. and uh, you wow. you know y'all referring to yourselves as Eddie and Martin or something. Yeah. Uh, wh what's up with that? Yeah. And we got something coming for y'all. You heard? Big shit. Big shit. That's my dog, man. What, what, uh, how do you and him link up? And what's what's there? Y'all got some special brewing? Just, 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 he trying to get me moving along. What? You better tell me to leave you alone? He on my phone. Do I need to every, call that every nigga? Week. Come on, Doug. Come on, Doug. Well, we get that the podcast. Three guys on the podcast. He got his own podcast? Shout out to Dizzy on that. Shout out to Dizzy. You, you'll get to see it. Uh, dude really want to work with me, too. Dude, wow. we really fucking lock in on some shit. And, um, yeah, we really, I seen the picture, nigga. I'm watching. We, we really fucking lock in, boss talk. I'm talking about some shit. It. Some next level shit. Nobody don't see coming. So you don't want to give us a little... No, well, don't you know, do it. Nigga gonna, steal, not, nigga gonna steal our idea, it's, no. And it's not that, but, you know, real recognized real. See, Desi is... Right. You know, he, he got, what, eight, nine, ten million followers? Yeah. Now, I'm mm -hmm. guessing 460,000. Yeah. But real recognized real, he know. Dub that nigga. Damn, I, yeah. I got to have you. I got to be around you. I, I, he'll tell you. I can, he can work with anybody he want to work with, but I'm that nigga. <laughs> Damn, it, boy. And I ain't got a... I ain't no hatred or no ill in my body, like... I appreciate you for looking out, bro. You mm -hmm. want to work with me? I'm going to go 10 times harder for you. Are That's you it. contemplating moving to Atlanta? No. I'm get, no, I'm not moving to Atlanta, but I'm getting a you spot see, down. You see, I have some forward. I get yeah, upset. Get a spot. That, that would make sense. And nigga, I help pay on it, nigga. You ain't leaving there, nigga. No, nah, but I'm getting a spot you know down there, though. Y'all yeah, welcome to come and for get the spot sure, down. For sure, I'm probably there, so we got to come. Got two Rockwallers and shit at the I gate. love Rockwallers. <laughs> That's my favorite dog. Uh, so tell me about Desi, baby. How did you actually meet him and, and, and Desi, just link I'm, with him? I met Desi, bro. Uh, he hit my inbox. Bro, uh, you a funny nigga. I love what you doing. Keep doing you. Ain't no we Like, bro, let's link. Let's link. So we finally link one day. And we do a skit. And he put the skit out. And took it down. What? Well, I say it was his skit, but it was really my skit because it was had something to do with snitching. It's okay. kind of like I had him snitching, and that's just not his, his people. His, yeah, yeah, his people. His not his character. So he hit me back. He's like, "Bro, here's the video. You know, you could put it out." 
And I fucked his mind up. I said, man, I don't give a fuck about that skit, nigga. That's the way we do it. Let's do something else. <laughs> and it, it, it took him like, damn, this dude ain't really just, you know, hot and trying to right. really get on. Right. This shit don't mean shit to me. By respect to us. It's by respect. Exactly. And then, because he always fuck with me, but this trash shit, fuck with him. He, he, yeah, you delivering that hoe, though. You fuck, he told me, say, bro, you hit the motherfucking jackpot. <laughs> <laughs> he called, say, bro, where you at? I said, I'm going to die. You hit the motherfucking jackpot, boy. No, I got nothing to talk. Hey, my boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, my yeah. boy. <laughs> hey, my boy. I'm going to FaceTime you right quick, my boy. Hey, look at him. <laughs> That's it, boy. Trash. He said, you found it. You found your niche. Damn. He said, game over. You found your niche. I like 40 years, too, man. I mean, you know, I really never just really just worked 40 years because of that situation I had with Pop Smoke people. Okay. And, you know, I never really wanted to talk about that as much until I got that situation worked out, right. which we all know we worked it out. But, yeah, uh, if I were to, I probably still can because my fans, be, they be wanting to hear they got the shows, the 40 years. <laughs> and I would never put it in my stand-up because I would want to always let the people know I got material, nigga. Yeah. I don't have to talk about this niche and shit. Mm. Yeah. Nigga pulled me to the side like, that's why I paid tickets for to hear 40 years, nigga. Damn right. That's I'm what gonna, they said. I'm going to hear that snitching shit, nigga. So I started adding that shit. A little bit. Like, damn, these nigga wasn't lying. Mm -hmm. People loving this shit. Like, damn. Now when I come out, it's trash. <laughs> I'm like, I ain't got to say shit for five minutes. I can come out, them people saying, trash. Mm -hmm. Love it. Trash. Love it. I'm soaking that shit in too, like I'm posed. <laughs> That's what Michael Jackson used to do. He just sat there and listened at the crowd. That video I just put out in Atlanta. Yeah. When I come out on stage, you never see me really smile. Yeah. I was smiling, you see me? Yeah. They would just chin, trash, trash. Like before I'd even deliver my jokes, they was already laughing. Damn. When you get to that point, it's on. It's on. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.